Thank you, Tony. New tonight, Top Golf is officially going to Cranston. The city council voted unanimously tonight to approve the project that's gotten mixed reviews from locals. One of the biggest concerns is the potential traffic the 35,000 square foot facility would bring. I with this news reporter Caroline Goggin has the details from the West Bay Mobile Newsroom. Well, Shannon and Mike, president of the Carpian Auto Group, Kelly Coates, tells me that tonight's unanimous vote speaks to the merits of this project. But some residents who were at the meeting who have voiced their opposition all along, they say they weren't surprised by the vote, but they're still disappointed. Top Golf is coming to Cranston. That was made certain after the Cranston City Council voted unanimously Monday night in favor of turning the old Citizens Bank headquarters on Sakanasa Cross Road into a Top Golf facility. Its developer, the Carpionato Group, estimates Top Golf will generate more than $1 million in tax revenue annually, while also creating 450 jobs in the city, 150 of which would be full time. Top Golf wants to come to one of our vacant properties and create a jewel in Cranston. I am in full support of this project. But not everyone is. As we've told you, many Princeton residents have voiced their opposition to the project over the last few months, concerned about many things, including traffic and noise the facility could create. The facility is going to look like an amusement park at night. And then we have the addition, of course, of the 176 foot high poles that are going to anchor uh, the netting that's going around the outfield, as they call it. Uh, those will be an eyesore. In fact, I'll be able to see them from my kitchen window. Despite those concerns, the project moves on. The Carpionato Group says it will now begin engineering work, meetings with the planning board, and licensing procedures with the city council. There are always going to be people who are concerned and nervous about change, but I, don't, I think there's been a groundswell of support for the project. Eventually, as this project goes forward, We'll have further objections, I'm certain of that. Now, it is interesting to note that Mayor Fung's wife was at tonight's meeting and spoke during public comment in support of the Top Golf plan. Coates tells me as of now, the plan moving forward is to start construction this fall with a plan to open the facility sometime in the fall of 2020 or in the first quarter of 2021. Reporting live in Cranston tonight, I'm Caroline Goggin, Eyewitness News.